Now with Calgary's Field Day, they're going to be on tour, playing this weekend in Quebec, May 13th, in Sudbury, May 14th, and Thunder Bay, um, May 21st and May 23rd in their hometown of Calgary, Alberta. You take care of yourselves. Tomorrow, Suede are coming in to play acoustically. So come on down or tune into the tube. Uh, here's Field Day. Bye. I like to think that punk rock is the kind of music that all of us started playing when we first picked up a musical instrument, whatever it was. I wouldn't really consider us a punk band. Outwardly. Outwardly. <laughs> yes, inwardly. <laughs> I'm going to keep it see but if I keep it inside, then I'm going to get all that psychic turbulence I was talking about. So. You got to get rid of that. Yeah, I know. Okay, we're punk. We're so damn punk. It's stupid. I have enough for you. Enough for me. Enough for you. I have enough to see you through. There's a certain sound, uh, namely the, the West Coast punk rock sound right now, which is dominant. And uh, you'll have uh, people at the, at the shows uh, uh, shouting at you on stage saying, play faster, play faster. And uh, you know, I, I think some of our songs, uh, remember when that was as fast as I could play. That's part of our problem in marketing our band is that uh, we're too fast for a lot of uh, overage adults and we're too slow for a lot of the kids. So, you know, you can't leave everyone, so do a rap song. Wrote some lyrics uh, dealing with, uh, I guess, uh, big skateboard wheels. Big skateboard <laughs> wheels. Uh, and at the time we wrote it, it's Things have changed a little bit in the past couple of years since then, wheels but uh, are wheels are getting bigger again. But there was a time where uh, skateboard wheels were uh, barely, barely larger than the bearings that they uh, covered. I don't understand this whole new school rig. You know I could pass if your pants are too big? Back then we had cobras, back then we had rails. Back then I could tell the nose from the tail. Is skateboarding important to you guys as a band? Just initially for me, like I'm, I just turned 32 and when I was 15, my brother came home from California uh, with some skateboard magazines and it introduced me to like the Dickies, the Damned, early Southern California punk rock and uh, that was our kind of, our, our Bible, Skateboarder and Thrasher magazine. And it definitely, there is that, always been that connection between freestyle sports, even skiing or whatever, and rock music surfing because surf music developed early in the 50s and 60s and uh, just with snowboarding skateboarding phenomena and how much you know there's not a lot of skateboarders listen to Brian Adams and, and Mariah Carey and stuff so it just seems to go a high energy freestyle sports with high energy music also have changed your hairstyles a bit like since certain videos. Well this isn't really a change hairstyle, <laughs> yeah. this is just not cutting it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm, cutting. I think I'm eight months since yeah. my last haircut. My hair is identical to uh, grade 11. <laughs> <laughs> I guess yeah. I had my dreads for seven years so we've gone through a bit of a change. Coming full circle. Oh, so we're still aware of that image. As far as public image goes, we had our first shower in three days today, so uh, <laughs> we feel pretty good. Yeah.